Hey everyone again, I guess this is becoming a common theme doing uh, videos from airports but I've been really really busy and I wanted to get something out to you before I went home to Australia. I'm in Bilbao at the moment, I've just uh, been in uh, Spain for the ITU Long Distance World Championships which finished about five hours ago. I had a pretty solid day, I grabbed myself a my fourth world title, I'm very very happy about that and Echo Lanos, the local guy was second and Dirk Bockel was third but I uh, it was a good return to long course racing for me. It's been a long time after chasing that Olympic dream, but I, I ran like a freight train today, so very, very happy. And I, I just spent the last month in Davos in Switzerland with uh, about five or six Olympic girls that are they're training for the Olympic Games, which is actually this weekend, this Sunday. So hopefully I'll get this out before, um, before the race. But uh, Lisa Norden, Katie Roberts, um, Vicky Holland from England, and. Uh, um, Annie Hag, the whole, whole crew of them, they're absolutely tearing the house down. Sarah Groff, um, and I, I wish them all the best. They're going to have an amazing Olympics, and, and they really got me into some good form because uh, I was a bit apprehensive about my first return to, to long distance racing. It was a four kilometre swim, a 120 kilometre bike, and a 30 kilometre run, and I got through it pretty well. So I think uh, I was told today that it was one of the fastest times, if not the fastest time ever, over that distance. So pretty happy about that. If you've been looking at my Facebook, you see that we've been getting a lot of the filming done for the MX-12 line. We've been talking about those 12 sessions. I, I'm trying to keep it as authentic as possible. So I, I said to the film crew, hey, let's do it when I'm actually doing those sessions. So we know, the, we know five or six of them now. So they're coming along nicely. Um, stay tuned for that. They're, hopefully you, you like them. They're not set in a the studio. They're real. So uh, they're 12 key sets that I do. And I'm trying to tell you how to fit those into your training program. So. It took a lot. It takes a lot longer than I thought it would, but it's. Uh, I've enjoyed the process, and uh, yeah, you're going to really, really like that. But what else has been happening? That's about it, actually. I convinced my sponsor, Beast Milk, to give away 500 free booster packs. So I think I've included the link with this video. So just click on that. The first 500 of you. I could only get them to give 500 away, but I've been promising on all these videos that I get as much free stuff to you guys as possible. So just click on the link and um, fill out your address and your name on the little form that they've made for you and they're going to ship you some uh, beast milk to try and, and give me some feedback, tell me what you think and uh, tell them what they think and I don't want to blow the, I guess I am going to blow the surprise but those 500 people that are the first ones in, we're going to draw at the end of that in about two months time, two of you people are going to be lucky enough to come and watch me in Kona this year so get onto it real quick, nail it and uh, who knows you might be coming to Kona to watch uh, in, win maybe a fifth world title in October. So, I wanted to get this out. Um, hope training and everything's going well for everyone. I know a lot of the English guys I met today, a few of you did the UK. Hope you had a, a great Ironman there. And for everyone in the States, who are racing Ironmans and 70.3s, all the best. Keep the feedback coming on Facebook. It's developing. Um, trust me, I've just been flat out trying to get fit and training done, and uh, things are going pretty well. So, cheers. Keep, feeding, keep hitting me with feedback, and uh, until next time, cheers. Give me a